Welcome to the real-time neural video decoding demo on a mobile device presented by Qualcomm AI Research. Video data is consuming an ever-increasing amount of IP traffic over the internet. Continual growth in demand across new and existing applications requires faster advancements in video compression technologies. To meet this demand and provide other desirable features, AI-based compression offers significant promise and has several compelling benefits, such as an improved rate distortion trade-off, providing the same level of visual quality with less bits, the ability to run on general purpose AI acceleration hardware rather than special purpose hardware, which will ease deployment, and the ability to more easily develop new codecs for new modalities, such as 3D or point cloud video. Driven by this potential, there has been active research on neural video codecs over the past few years, showing impressive compression performance and closing the gap to conventional codecs. In neural video coding, each iframe is coded using an intraframe codec. For each p-frame, a reference frame, which is usually the previous decoded frame, is used to facilitate the coding process and provide more bitrate savings. Interframe coding is often done in two steps. In the first step, an autoencoder measures and compresses the optical flow between input and reference followed by warping to generate a prediction. In the second step, another autoencoder compresses the residuals between input and prediction. Since most existing research uses high-end GPUs with floating-point computation and the neural network models are often not optimized for fast inference, there is uncertainty about the feasibility and costs to run this inference on power, thermal, and compute-constrained devices. At Qualcomm AI Research, our target is to achieve efficient neural video coding on mobile devices. We overcome the neural codec feasibility challenges as follows. First, to address the challenge of neural video compression network architectures with high complexity, we designed a novel efficient architecture customized for mobile AI accelerators. Second, as floating point operations are highly inefficient, we quantize the network weights from 32-bit floating point to 8-bit integer using the quantization-aware training tools provided by Qualcomm Innovation Center's AI Model Efficiency Toolkit. Finally, since the latent variables in the autoencoders are conditionally independent, we developed an entropy coding algorithm able to encode and decode latent variables using multi-thread concurrency. Here is the setup of our demo. We take a 1280 by 720 resolution video as input and generate the compressed bitstream by running the encoder network and entropy encoding offline. The compressed bitstream is processed by the parallel entropy decoding and decoder network running on a mobile device powered by the Snapdragon 8 mobile platform. Specifically, the parallel entropy decoding runs on CPU cores, and the decoder network is accelerated on the 7th generation Qualcomm AI engine. The result is the first neural interframe decoding algorithm that runs at 30 frames per second on a mobile device. Now let us take a closer look at our neural video decoder running on this commercial phone powered by our latest generation Snapdragon 8 processor. At the center is the video decoded and displayed in real time. The decoded video resolution is 1280 by 720 or HD 720p. The running number in the upper right corner shows the decoding speed in terms of frames per second or FPS. The loop count shows how many iterations are completed for the same input stream. The running average bitrate and bits per pixel are displayed on the right. For this demo, video encoding parameters were set to high quality and a sequence of scenes was chosen for a wide variety of challenging motions and detailed textures. A close look shows that the rich visual structures and complex motions are accurately preserved by the neural network-based coding process, resulting in excellent scene reproduction. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more advancements in neural codecs coming from Qualcomm AI Research.